This is the Wellsville Municipal Pool. It opens every year on the first day of summer. It closes just after Labor Day. And in between lies paradise. For those 12 weeks, every radio station plays your favorite song. Every can opener feels like it's in slow-mo. And every trip to the deep end seems more beautiful than the last. In this chlorinated wonderland, one person was in charge of preserving the peace. That person was me. What? He started it! Most of my subjects obeyed me. Some would come to adore me. But in the end, one would try to destroy me. With most summer jobs, you whack some weeds, inhale some paint fumes, maybe scrape at some grill gunk with a spatula, and then you look up, and the summer's gone. There's one job, however, where you don't miss the summer. You rule the summer. And this is your throne, the Krebstar 2000 Hydro Thruster. Fully loaded with hydraulic lift controls and butt-friendly no-stick cushions. GP, I don't know. Do you think you can handle it? I think the question is, can the hydro thruster handle me? Handle this. Soon you will know my power. Oh, and what power would that be, rookie? You gotta learn to crawl before you can fly. Meet head lifeguard Matt Uplinger, your average, ordinary, power-tripping moron with a not-so-average need to be taken seriously as a full-blown adult. Thank you, Mr. Java, for being so good to me. Hmm. Nothing like a cup of fresh brew to get you going. Right, Mr. W? Makes me want to go out there and build a mighty dam. So, uh... While you're out, would it be okay if I sat in the chair? Didn't I mention something about learning to crawl? By that, Opplinger meant learning to suck, as in the big suck. A job that yielded many treasures from the deep. Looking good, Rook. Starting tomorrow? There's something else in that water I'm gonna need you to deal with. No, Matt. Not the... I'm afraid so. There's a dark side to the paradise of the pool. A yellow evil that lurks in the warm spots created by a mysterious pea terrorist known only as... <laughs> yes. The Urinator. Somebody is going to do something. It's a chemical agent that reacts with human tinkle. When our twisted mastermind strikes, oh, and he will. Bright green slick is going to lead us right to him. So until then, we just wait, right? Wrong. 
Of all the fantasies I had ever had about being a lifeguard, none of them involved searching for a madman with a bladder problem. But I had to find him, if I ever wanted to sit on the throne of summer. What are you doing? Monica Prime reporting for duty. You want to nail this punk? Put a Krebs scout on your pee patrol. Fine, just keep it down with that pee patrol stuff, okay? Oh, I get it. An undercover job. Smart. I'm with you, Condor. Keep me covered. Hey, Pete. Uh, How's it going? This is your second day, right? Yeah. Hey, Wendy. It's the second day. A lot of um, a lot of action. Just uh, just save the kid's life, uh, right, Ellen? He's so brave. Uh, I'm a lifeguard. Guarding lives is what I do at this pool. Pretty big. No hot spots in this quadrant, Condor. We're in a wee wee free zone. My perfect summer was melting like a sludge sickle. But then Uplinger uttered two words. Two words that changed the tide of history. You know what that music means, youngsters. It's time for Adult Swim! Once again, won't you please welcome the adults of Wellsville Municipal Pool. Weighing in at a sturdy 240 pounds, he's a driving range owner that likes to call himself the king of the road. Say hi to Don Wrigley! Next, metal plating and stall makes her shake like a stone, but that doesn't stop her from being the lily of the pond. Nothing makes a kid's blood boil more than the dreaded adult swim. Ever since 1954, when the Supreme Court declared them constitutional, kids have been deprived of their inalienable right to do underwater handstands whenever they want to. Maybe you can stop me, butt linger. Maybe you can stop Wade. Ah, the mesh is chafing me. But there's one kid you can't stop. Hey, everybody. Raise your hand if you like electric eels. Pete's sabotage had toasted Adult Swim. And according to Uplinger, my shot at senior lifeguard would be toast too. Unless I somehow talk some sense into my brother. Pete Wrigley on the warpath. He's kicking butt. He's taking names. He's kicking butt all over again. Man, oh man, did you show Uplinger who rules the pool. Uplinger's a brain clock. <laughs> you got that right, pal. He actually thought he could get me to pressure you into laying off adult swim. That's so. Uh, You're crazy, right? Where do I go? I told him, Matt, being a senior lifeguard might be the only thing I've ever wanted in my whole life. But I'm not gonna put the squeeze a on my old bro just to get it. I mean, if Pete wants to be a nice guy, that's one thing. But I... Look, adult swim is a disease. The pool is for everybody. Why do they get to hog it? Exactly right, bro. That's what I told Matt myself. I felt like a rat think. But Uplinger had left me with no choice. To get the ultimate job, I'd have to protect Adult Swim with the ultimate weapon. Of all the low things you've ever done, this is the lowest. Thank you for sharing. This Adult Swim is brought to you by Crab Full of Nuts Coffee. The fresh roast flavor adults prefer. Three to one. Now clear the pool! <laughs> Forgive me, Pete. It was the unmistakable sound of Mr. Tasty's magical ice cream chimes. No kid could resist it.
I'm impressed, rookie. What do you say you and me, we make a deal? You keep your brother away from Adult Swim for the rest of the week, and I'll crown you senior lifeguard. Finally, I'd be king, and along with my throne would come the power, the glory, and the dog? Vengeance will be mine, Blowhole! My brother and I had fought epic battles before, but never had the stakes been so high for both of us. Pete's dream was to destroy Adult Swim. If I stopped him, I'd get a shot at my dream to rule the pool as a senior lifeguard. If I didn't take him on, I had a disgusting feeling my summer was going to be a long one. Ugh. Monica, I'm in a warm spot. The urine eaters got me. Don't move, Condor. I'm going to go down and get some readings. If it's fresh, we might have a shot at getting that whiz master. Oh. Hey, Pete. What's the matter? You look kind of worried. Worried? Yeah, I am worried. Worried about the safety of the people in this pool. Yeah, it's an important thing Wait. to me. You won't believe it. The warm spot you're standing in is only three minutes old. Enough was enough. I knew what I had to do. I'm your man, Matt. Let's get this over with. You make the call, Rook. Now remember, you've got the power to dock. Three docks, and it's goodnight, Irene. Your brother's banned from the pool for the entire summer. Attention! Attention! All you youngsters, it's time for Adult Swim! He's out there, Alan. I can feel it. He's waiting to make his move. He's toying with me. Ma'am, great day for a swim, wouldn't you say? Oh, you, you got that right, Sonny. <gasps> Infiltrating Adult Swim and then pulling the plug in the pool was a brilliant plan. But in the end, it was no match for the big suck. <laughs> oh, sorry, Pete. You know the rules. I'm gonna have to dock you. Didn't we used to be brothers? Don't make this any harder than it has to be. Think this is hard now? Just you wait. While I waited for Pete's counter-strike, I tried to warn adults that one docking was nothing to a commando like my brother. Nobody seemed too worried, though. Make the swan! Gross. I think I'm gonna Ralph. What are you doing? I'm sending a secret emergency distress call to Pete. I saw it once on a flipper. Wayne, you're such a... Doc, mister, that's two. One more, and you can say sayonara to your summer. Blow it out your ear hole. Don't you think this has gone far enough? He is your brother. Or, he was. Hey, you're a Wrigley. Wrigley's work things out. Uh, talk to him. Pete, this whole thing is your fault, not mine. You guys hear something? Just the wind flapping. 
I think I heard a bee. This is so stupid. You could be swimming right now. Just get it through your head. Adults have rights too. Not to kick us out any time they want. The whole world is theirs. All we're asking for is one stinking pool. We belong here, and you know it. Pete, things are different now. I'm a lifeguard. No, you're not. You're a traitor to all kids everywhere. Was I a traitor? Maybe. My brother Pete waited the whole year for summer. If I docked him one last time, it would all be over in an eye blink. Lindy, what are you doing here? The pool's closed. I know, but I just love swimming at night. Oh, me too. The water seems more slippery. It's so quiet. You can hear your heartbeat. I know. Hey, sweetheart. Thought you wanted to swim. Well, we were just talking. Oh, I'm sorry, Puddin. Till he proves himself tomorrow, all he's allowed to do is suck. Isn't that right, Rookie? <laughs> See you tomorrow, Pete. Yeah. See ya. The next day, I knew what had to be done. Brother or no brother, there was no turning back. The fate of the whole summer would come down to one last adult swim. Give me the mic, Matt. Now. Take us home, Rook. Kids, out. Adults. In. That means you, Mrs. Blotard. Let's get that rear in gear! It would all be over in 60 minutes. Enough time for Pete to attack from any angle with any weapon. You made this pool safe for adults everywhere. Uh -uh. There's still a minute left. You broke him. You showed him. Who rules this pool? Take the throne. Mr. Senior Lifeguard. The Hydro Thruster? <sighs> Help yourself to a cup of hot brew. You burned it. Ah, thank you, Mr. Java. You're so very good to me. Finally, I was the king of summer, the master of the pool, and the master of my destiny. swim left. If you jump now, I'll have to dock you. You'll be banished for the entire season. Just wait ten more seconds. Why blow your whole summer? Because there are some things in life we're dying for. You used to know that. You used to care. So go ahead. Destroy me. My splash will live on. <laughs> No! 
lifeguard. Begin docking procedures now! Did you see that splash? Woo! 50 megatons! Maybe even a hundred! You wanna sit in that chair, Wrigley? You gotta pull the handle! Do it! Flush that corn dog right out of here. I hate to do this, Pete, but you leave me no choice. How was it? Total annihilation! You call that a splash? Let me show you the way we used to do it back in the Motor City. Pete's atomic can opener had created a nuclear chain reaction that nothing could stop. And as adults remembered how to be kids again, everyone forgot why they needed adult swims in the first place. Show some dignity, you act your age! You! Do you have anything to say before I dethrone you? Yeah, as a matter of fact, I do. Urinator! What? What's this? It's you! Is that what you think of? This is a setup! I'm one of you! You want to hold your own with the adult sublinger? You gotta hold it in! I don't know what you're talking about! Ask your bladder then! It'll tell you. Too much coffee. You had to go bad. Real bad. Bad enough to switch the chemicals so that you wouldn't get caught. Too bad I caught on. Urinator! And so, the evil urinator was destroyed. Adult Swim was officially dead. And as for Pete's splash, it did live on. Here at the Wellsville Municipal Pool, known to some as Paradise. Monsters.